What's up, everybody? I said I was going to do this re this review on the, uh, the blocks. I didn't get to it last night because everybody, you know, watching the game, of course. So this morning, about to go to work, so I'll throw one out for you. The blocks. Just got done with it. All done. I did my last serving last night on my chest workout. And as far as the supplement goes, Taste-wise, it's excellent. It's real crisp, clean. Uh, intro workout works works good. I mean, what I don't like is why I don't see why I need to take this pre-workout. It says take one pre-workout, a scoop, one intro workout, and one after you workout. I think that's a little bit too much. I think they're doing that to make you use more of this stuff. And it's halfway full when you get it, so they're trying to make you run it out, I guess, because I don't think you need that much. I mean, if this is an ultra-concentrated, pretty much ultra-concentrated BCAs, then I don't think you need that much during the day. So I follow the directions to a T, and I can't say that this did too much for me. I mean, as far as endurance in the gym... I'm not sure. I'm not sure because I was taking the no you know, explode and this Hickamax, which also promises, you know, more endurance in the gym and you know better workouts and things. So the real test is gonna be after I stop using this right now and see if anything changes because I don't know what was giving me the endurance. I'm telling you, but this Plus this and this, this stack right here, I felt a complete change in my workouts. But the problem is, of course, we don't know which one did it. I know the NO Explode gave me the pumps and the strength. And I know this Hickamax you know, decreased my arm that set soreness, delayed soreness. So I know that did that. I'm not sure what this did. I know it gave me a good drink in the gym, you know, really refreshing and all that stuff, but I'm not sure. So me coming off of this right now, I'm going to see if anything changes. I'm just going to be using the Hickamax and the, uh, the Inno Explode and probably just be using water just to see, you know, if there's a change from this. As far as the price goes, I do not recommend this. This stuff is like $35. Uh, like I said, it's only halfway filled up. You don't get a good amount. And they want you to take it even on your off days, which is, I guess it's understandable. You want to take it every day. So it's one scoop on your off days. So you run out of this thing real quick. Plus, the price is, is kind of steep. I'd wait for this to go down because not this is the first of its kind on the market. So you're not going to see too many other products like this for a while. So I went ahead and tried. I mean, that tastes great. I thought I felt something, but I can't, I can't break it down to see which one was actually giving me what I was getting. But the stack, like I just showed you, was phenomenal. I mean, this might just be my, my, my personal preference, man. My take on this is this plus the Hickamax plus the NO Explode. I never went wrong. I had the, the energy every time I went in the gym. I had the pumps. I had the strength increase so but I just don't know which one was doing it. If this had anything to do with it, probably did. But once I come off of this, we'll see. And I'll cut another review about maybe a week after I stop using this, which will be starting today, to see if anything changes. If nothing changes, I wouldn't be buying this again. But I will let you know. If you want to give it a shot, go ahead. If you got the extra thirty five dollars, which is I think real expensive for half a container of something they want you to use every day and one and every time you work out three times a day you're gonna run out of this real quick but we'll see man we'll see so give me about a week I'll let you know if you want to go ahead and try it go for it man I'm not saying not I'm just saying let's see which really gave me that extra edge in the gym so I'll see you next time with the follow-up review